everybody, this is uh, Dom aka Sales from Team Pro ATC X Forums, you may know me from there. Today I want to show you how you get uh, a manual route into the MCDU of the MD11. As I'm uh, constantly reading uh, questions over this, uh, how to repair several aircraft with manual, um, with manual flight plan manualizations and how this is actually done. So I will uh, try to show you today just how you import a route into the uh, CPU, how to get a certain star in there and uh, we will stay on the ground all the time. And um, yeah, so we just start. We just started to load up the plane, there is nothing configured already really now. So um, we start with the uh, left the CPU here, go to the flat plan in it. We will not use the company route, we will, uh, we will insert this manually. So we will miss our flight from uh, Frankfurt to Berlin Tegel here. Um, we will just import um, from 2. So the band knows where we go. Does not find any company route. Uh, the 11 always uh, searches for uh, for a company route. Doesn't find any because there is no. But it's still in there. So um, we leave all the alternate routes uh, blank and so on. Just uh, give it a flight number here with my name. And um, yeah, so far so good. Then we go to the uh, flat plan here, which has now just the uh, from and to and nothing in between. So we will insert it here. You click on the first um, on the first uh, on the departure airport. Um, or we could um, just insert our airport in here. So I will have to route in the uh, YouTube um, comment section below so you can actually follow what I'm doing. The first way point is Tobak, which is actually the set exit point. Um, from there we will uh, fly an airway to Galma and in the direct to Bartle, which is the star entry, so the route is quite short. If you now want to import an airway, you can't just type it in here. You have to open the waypoint um, on which the airway starts. Good go to here, you see the information for Tobac and click on Airways. Now you can import the Airway, which is in our case in November 858 here. Put it in there and then you have to select where it's going from there. This is actually Galma. So if you would fly another Airway from Galma, you could already insert it here. You don't have to uh, go all the way back to the flight plan and insert a new waypoint and so on. You can do it quite, quite easily from here, but we're not doing this. We're flying a direct uh, after Galma, so we will insert it uh, insert here. And um, already see that the uh, 11 MCU puts the airway in here, all the waypoints on the airway to Galma. Nothing after Galma, so we will put our direct in here, which is. Uh, you see um, if there are several bartels in the navigation uh, database, then it will ask which one you want to fly. The um, nearest one is always on top, as you see, 17 nautical miles, and the uh, uh, coordinates more or less. So um, we will use the nearest one. We don't want uh, to fly 4,000 nautical miles. Put it in here, it's in there, and After that, it's Tegel. So basically, that's your route in there, just without sits and stars. So you would continue with your normal start flow of the plane, and um, then request uh, clearance, which you will then get. So you will be assigned a, a sit prior of uh, starting, surely. So um, you go back to the, to the top, select EDF our departure airport when we insert a sit and click on the sit. 
corresponding to this card. Um, and can now select either sit on the left side or runways on the right side, the MCD will filter. So um, if you activate the next 6 Lima here, you will just see runways which is filled for. Or on the other hand, if you select runway 07 center, as we will now, it will just show you the sits that are valid for this runway. It's actually quite a nice feature. So we are um, uh, flying uh, from 07 uh, center, the Toba um, 8 Delta departure. It's in here, so we select it. TMCU will show us what is selected. And we then insert this into our uh, flight plan. So, now we're back on the flight plan, we see there is the runway um, and the restrictions until 800 feet to 20 knots, until the F149. You see here announced the uh, SIT, which waypoint. Uh, so the waypoint belongs to the SIT and when the airway comes the waypoint belongs to which airway. Which is actually quite a nice feature if you're um, Following you around, following what you're doing. So, um, you see in the navigational display, it's already in there. Alright, so we would um, just uh, check in plan mode if this is working for us. And decrease it. Okay, this is, this is okay for this purpose. So, we will click through. That the route we just entered is the route we want to, to work, to swim from. Balma, left turn direct to battle and nothing from there because we just not entered our star. The star starts at battle. So for entering the stars there um, is one little thing you could add it at the destination as you see here but you don't want to. The uh, star has to be added on the star entry point. You could enter it on the uh, destination airport. The problem is just that the um, 11 would then overfly the destination first and go then back to the star, which makes no sense. So we select battle, which is our star entry. If it's corresponding to uh, a star, you will see the, uh, the star selection here. You can select it and see again on the right side the approaches and uh, later down just the runways. Yeah. And um, the stars that are available again. It's uh, filtering, so if you select runway first, then you will see only corresponding stars. If you select star, then you will only see corresponding runways. We will land either 0 7 left, so we will select it here, see the corresponding uh, stars. Our star today will be about uh, 6 Zulu, so we select it. We have uh, no transition, so this can be inserted simply as that. We now could select the transition, as I said, there, don't, uh, there is no. So, we will go in here and see what the FMC or the MCDU did. So we fly from Battle to Girit, the Battle 6 Zulu arrived to Lanu with a restriction of 10,000 feet. Then we have a, a discontinuity to Ligba. Normally there would be a transition, s transition starting or ATC would vector you. Um, in this case, we can just fly or can assume uh, an indirect click bar. So we will delete the discontinuity. This is a little bit different to the uh, to the Boeing uh, FMC style. You can can't just select it and put it up here. Here, you have to delete the discontinuity. So we will do this. Clear. This you see, it's together again, and um, we will. Then cross check in the plan mode uh, on the navigation display if this is correct. So we are currently at Battle, then Girit, then Lano, Ligba, Otamaka, the runway. And additionally, uh, on the, um, the right side of the airport here um, is the Mr. Post procedure. Already in there, so if you have a missed approach, the uh, MCU will auto fly it. So that's it. You uh, just got your um, route manually in the MCDU of the MD11, including sits and stars. And uh, yeah, it's easily done.
and uh, wish you always good flying and a lot of fun. Bye.